Hello everyone, Nazanogami here, welcome back to Let's Play where they cremate the roadkill. Where you last left off, we find out it was the devil that bleached the bleached the rift. And we get a flashback to uh Cooley's father. Really he adopted Cooley and we had a drink from a chalice and uh don't really know what effects effects has so far on us and I can't access the menu from here. Oh yeah, and we get a new car! Courtesy of the devil himself. So where do we go? I think that little city block was in New Nigeria, and what do you want now? Let's not beat around the bush. You think I'm something, but I'm only what you've made me. A pretend object, the point at which you project and concentrate all your faults. That's the me you need in order to cope. So you're either Juan or Sydney or Cindy. Very obscure Dilbert reference for the lose. Just blame invisible people. With the flat truth of your own personal failure, the cosmic cause giving an external excuse for your mistakes. Well, I don't think an imaginary person can give me a new car and the cat phone. I think it wants me dead, by the way. Just like how cats want, secretly want their owners dead. The cat phone secretly wants to kill me. No surprise given it used to be my gun. I know it. I know all about it. And we're just here. <laughs> and, uh, we got dead coolies! On pikes. Sharp with a stick on both ends. I think that's what the devil's doing for me. The 10,000 questions are one question. If you cut through the one question, then the 10,000 disappear. But then again, I don't think the devil really wants me dead. I mean, he's been assisting me so far. I mean, he gave me the cat phone. He, uh... Busted me out of jail. Gave me the car. <laughs> my entire life is a lie. I stay with my wife and play a good husband for my kids. But if I never saw her again, I wouldn't even remember what my last words were to her. Nor would I care. I don't know what to say to you. It's kind of cool. But none of you guys are. None of those things are going to give me items, apparently. Yet. Yep, there's. Another guy on my hit list, not gonna bother. I prefer liberty with danger to slavery with security. Speaking of security, what's with this gate? I see little things up there. I can't interact with the gate. Can I attack? I can attack the gate! And it does zero damage. But it has an HP bar. We'll come back to that later, I think. Find a, a key or something. Uh, I don't like this at all. Oh wait, here we go again. levels up by doing nothing! <laughs> or just by looking. And I'm level 10. <laughs> I like this. 
this. Although I do kind of have to... Invisible pixel hunt at... Times. Like that. Is that... It looks like that's it. That was fun. While it lasted. Rehab is for quitters. It's for those who want to... Oh, no! I hate this. What the heck? It's like, all of a sudden, hammer time! But yeah, rehab is for quitters. It's for those who want to quit their addictions. the UFO is trying to kill me. Let me get some space, get some space, get some space. I have any, uh, no new abilities. Get him, Noshka! You're doing horrible! Well, doesn't have that much HP, actually. <laughs> A single mistake should be met with forgiveness. Oh, and that heals me up. Nice. Liquid bread. Basically. Put it in your mouth. No! I think that's gonna kill me. Let me save. If it gives you an option to do it, then it's probably gonna kill you. No, it didn't kill me, it just put me in a state of confusion. Very appropriately enough. I think I'll... Yeah, this is backwards controls. <laughs> I'm not really a ma- I wouldn't call myself a master of backwards controls, but... I played several games that incorporate that. On my wall hangs a Japanese carving. The mask of an evil demon, decorated with gold liqueur. Sympathetically, I observe the swollen veins of the forehead, indicating what a strain it is to be evil. Japanese demon. Is it the Oni? I'm guessing it's the Oni. Or the Hanya mask. It's... Yeah, more commonly the Hanya mask. More arrows! Apparently, I can't talk to you. Friendly looking stranger. Wait, no, yeah, I can. To become imperceptible oneself, to have dismantled love in order to become capable of loving. To have dismantled oneself in order to finally be alone and meet the true double at the other end of the line. To paint oneself gray on gray. I can only make a witty remark to that. I float on water and can fit in the palm of your hand. I sleep below ground, but if you dig, I won't be found. A tall tower, a small tree, I climb both in twelve steps. I can pierce the skull of a man without killing him. Who am I? Okay, try to answer with an inventory item? What do I have? But... Float on water. Kill a man. A 
if you're in the ground. Are you Ebola? No. The sun. Skill was at your retinue. Is the sun the answer? Is that the answer? Portable radio, can I use this? Alone without another. I can play music. When did I get this thing? Oh, at my own radio. With strange titles. How many songs do I have on this thing? It's actually not nice. Buzz, the bees are dead. How many do we have? Got ten songs on this thing. Who am I, huh? Makes you think back to the piece of music of the same name from uh, Final Fantasy VII. Very freaky. Anything from the walkie? No sign of God. I float on water and can fit in the palm of your hand. Sleep below ground, but if you dig, I won't be found. Fit in the palm of your hand. A tall tower. A small tree. I, I climb both in 12 steps. I can pierce the skull of a man without killing him. This is making no sense, but I'll go for it. Oh wait, is this like a... Soiler concentrate. Better not be like a vermis or anything. Float on water. It's one of those vague answers. Can I even? I can't present any of these. It's just a, a, a big steep. I thought Ebola means microscopic. I was thinking viruses, but... Pierce the skull of a man without killing him. I don't know. above your head. Is it the sun? Wow, so my riddle was too easy to guess. I'll have to think of a harder one. The sun? I mean, if you're talking about light, but do I seriously not get any reward for this? If so, that's a big stink. Go ahead and save. A tomb now suffices him for whom the world was not enough. More secret doors. I'm loving this. I am not loving all the dead coolies, though. Come on. Th th 
talk to me! The mob rushes in where individuals fear to tread. String... String theory! Is that like an actual theory? String theory? It sounds like it could be, but... Let's have a look. That's another one of these items. Persistent critic. I gotta wonder about that one. Persistent critic. to get anything for this slot. Hey, let me look everything carefully, because... Ah, uh, here it is. Spell cast. That is so, so vague. Oh yeah, I forgot I got a new skill. Um, tongue lash. Kill my enemies with insults. Wait a minute, didn't that just come from that way? Is it just gonna put me in loops? Actually might be the case. Gonna put me in loops. And in that case, the only way to go is through that gate. Bomb. Oh yeah, we're gonna bomb the gate. That actually makes sense. Question is, what would you do if you don't have any bombs? Yay! What? Huh. There was a, a temporary invisible wall. And that guy is spawning cats.
finally got someone from my hit list. Whoops. Well, let's see what email we get as a result. Uh. Dragons, like the fish tribe, seem to have no bounds put to their growth. Their bones are in a great measure cartilaginous, and they are consequently capable of great extension. The older, therefore, a dragon becomes, the larger it grows, and, as they live to a great age, they arrive at an enormous size. Perhaps if one was old enough, it could grow to the size of a universe. So it's saying that dragons are koi. Reptilian koi. When you put your faith in big government, you end up an apologist for mass murder. Uh Reality is a temporary resultant of continuous struggles between rival gangs of programmers. <laughs> is that like a smart talk to other game developers or just programmers in general? The, to the totally convinced and the totally stupid have too much in common for the resemblance to be accidental. Gullibility, my friend. And uh, there seems to be nothing here. Nice little flute going, though. Let's see. Ideology always paves the way toward atrocity. The virtue of the projecting becomes the shackles for the receptive. A slave collar studded with jewels is still a slave collar. So many comparisons can be said with that. I don't know what that thing is. My first impression is that it looks like a toilet. So... Yeah, just throwing toilets. Why not? Are you a good guy or a bad guy? Monks meditate in the forest and temples, but my place of compensation is the toilet. And just as I was talking about toilets, let's see. False, do what right, and Eleanor Roosevelt, to add F O F. Illuminati snake. people actually meditate on the toilet. Is, it, is this another one of you? After so long, why? Isn't it true that organic life becomes messy? What do you mean, cat? to the music. Oh. And here I thought I was approaching something ominous. I say as I walk across the snout of a gator. Truths and roses have thorns about them. That is so true. Thanks. Wait, so what does the sun actually do? Okay. 
Looks like it did nothing. Is it only good for that riddle? Hey! The, my frame rate! Super cop! Man, I hate it when I go to new screens and, uh... They remove my, uh... My... My... Default. You take care of it, Noshka. <laughs> its attacks are slowing down my frame rate. He's gotta die. saliva at this rate. Switch back. Where do I go? I just came from the center. Dead ends and uh, well, one more Jupiter rock, just one more. Eat right, exercise regularly, die anyway. That's a kind of a pessimistic attitude. Wait, no, this is somewhere different. And I see a dog. I'm gonna name you Muffins. And see, the cat that has been scalded flees from cold water. Oh no, that dog looks like a Muffins. It's like I look at an animal, see how it is, and then I just give it a nickname and... Am I seriously back here? Ah! New place! things revert to normal that it gets me but so what I learned there's you can't map this place if you're patient in one moment of anger you will skip a hundred days of sorrow Sometimes it just kind of darts off. Yeah, Nashka does more damage. Because at, at times it just scoots off to the side instead of just being an enemy seeker.
We admire people to the extent that we cannot explain what they do. And the word admire then means, means marvel at. Also, it looks like Noshka doesn't really differentiate between aggressive enemies and passive enemies. Well, even then, those aren't really enemies. So, there is no coherency. Or little to no coherency. Gonna make it very difficult to navigate. But at least we have this thing. So, I seriously don't get reward. No reward for solving your riddle. I can't even go back this way. Now this is gonna be a little tough to navigate. Forwards and backwards. Unless, do I have to destroy these uh, things? I'm gonna check real quick. It's like, it's the only thing I could think of. Try the bombs again. Seriously. Well, I got some item from that poor guy. Not worth it though. Uh, and to see what my options may be next time. Till then, this is Nazo signing off. I can see this is going to be a very big pain.